Hi, today we're going to show you one way that you can make a beaded pacifier clip using some of our pacifier clip craft kits. Um, so in order to do that, you will need nylon cord, a clip of some kind, some silicone or wood beads, as well as either a larger pin or a paper clip, which we provide in all of our craft kits that you can actually straighten out. So the first thing you want to do is lay out your beads, and I've done that here. And then you're going to take some nylon cord, and you're going to want to measure it beside the beads, and then a little bit further up. And the reason you want to do that is you're going to make space for your loop, and all the way back down. Now you want to just double check that this is about the right length. And in order to do so, you're going to want to kind of give it a rough measure to see that you've got the loop side almost as long as the beads that you've got laid out. And that looks about good to me. So I'll give that a snip. So one of the reasons we like this particular system that I'll show you today is because it actually allows us to have a double strand of the nylon cord throughout the entire bead strand, as well as the loop is secured with a very, very handy knot called the fisher double fisherman's knot. And the reason I like this particular knot is that when we're pulling against it, and I'll show you that in a minute, all that's going to happen is that you're actually going to tighten that knot up rather than potentially loosen it off. So in order to do that, you're going to actually take these two tails and line them up. I'm just going to do that in my hands here. You're going to take the bottom one and fold it up and over and loop it around and then you're going to loop it around a second time so you end up having two little loops you're going to tuck that tail in and through and pull you're going to do the same thing on the other side except for this time you're going to take the top cord you're going to fold it down and again you're going to loop it around twice so that you have two loops and tuck the tail in and pull. Now when you're pulling together, you'll see that the more you pull, the tighter the knot will get, rather than potentially loosening off. Once you've got that there, you're just going to simply snip these ends off and we're ready to make our pacifier clip. Okay, so now we've got our nice secure loop. Like I said, this was really tight. We are going to take it in one hand and I'm gonna choose the beechwood clip here. You're going to push this down through the beechwood clip loop and then slide the rest of the loop through. Now at this point, you can do it however you feel you'd like to. Some people may choose to actually do a knot at the bottom, but this isn't necessary. This is all your craft and you can absolutely do it how you feel comfortable. So once you've done that, you're going to take your paper clip or your pin and just string it on the edge. And then you simply need to push the beads through Should we start out at that end. As you can see, they're coming on very, very nice and easy. And because you've laid it out, it's quite quick. And we'll do these last three beads. And then we just have to remove the pin and secure the top knot. So now I like to pull one of these beads right over top of that knot. That'll hide that knot. And keep it there. Now if you wanted you could make your loop a little bit longer at the end and feed this through a second time and that will help secure this end bead from getting loose or you can simply tie a nice double knot and this is a nice simple double knot feed it through twice pull tight and here is your clip.